So the singer Tank was on the Stephen A. Smith show, and he made the statement that has gone viral that he feels that Chris Brown is better than Michael Jackson. Of course, Stephen A. Smith was like, whoa, what are you talking about? Because Michael's just in a whole other level, which I have to agree. Michael Jackson is really in a league of his own. I don't understand why people constantly want to say they're better than Michael Jackson. No disrespect to Tank, but I disagree with what he's saying. Chris Brown will tell you or has said that he does not consider himself to be better than Michael Jackson. Chris Brown also learned from Michael Jackson, so it's really almost like teacher-student. I agree with Tank that next generation artists, they can definitely evolve and take an art form further, but Michael, again, is just in a league of his own. And he had a career that was about 40 years or longer. He started as a child and transitioned into adulthood and just took it to the stratosphere. I would say that a lot of the modern artists of today, like a Chris Brown or like an Usher, et cetera, to me, they are they have elements of Michael Jackson for sure, but they also are very similar to a Bobby Brown, who also was just a dynamic performer during his heyday. I think people forget that. To me, these modern day performers are very similar to him in terms of the singing and the rapping and and all that, the type of musical stylings. But Michael, again, just in a league of his own, I know Tank made the argument that, you know, Chris Brown, He's better as a writer, he's better as a singer, he's better as a dancer, uh, is what he said. And he said that Michael worked with so many different people to make his particular sound and production great. And yes, he did. He worked with Quincy Jones, one of the greatest as well. He worked with other writers, Teddy Riley, etc., But Michael also orchestrated a lot of his music. He wrote a lot of those hits that you hear. He wrote Billie Jean. He wrote a lot of those songs. Uh, He did not play an instrument, but he would vocalize what he wanted his instrumentation to sound like. So Michael was just genius, and he studied everyone. Everyone who knew him at Motown said he was like a sponge. He would sit back and study you, and then create his own stylings from what he studied from you. And if you look at his performances, you can see how he was inspired by the likes of James Brown, Jackie Wilson, Sammy Davis, even Diana Ross, but he made it his own. He was a true artist. And let's just let him be great. Let's stop trying to say someone is better than him. Let's just say he is great He is the greatest, and anyone who has studied from him, they too are great. I believe Chris Brown is a great artist. Now, you can maybe argue that he is the best student of Michael Jackson, but to say he's better than Michael Jackson, I just feel is a little too far. Because even Michael Jackson, when he would talk about those who inspired him, if you listen to some of his interviews, If he talked about James Brown, Jackie Wilson, or Sammy Davis, he would always say they are the greatest. He would never say, I'm better than them. So I just hope that we as a culture truly respect those who came before us and stop trying to take their position. Just appreciate what they taught us, what they offered us. And yes, let's continue to elevate the culture, elevate the art form, but we don't need to say we're better than anyone. But that's my thoughts for today. I'm Stacy Brewer, and this is H Blues Word. Peace. It's, it's H Blues Word.